Hey guys, so today, <laughs> that was the slowest wave clap ever. Hey guys, so today I'm doing a little playtime sort of tutorial first impression slash review on the new Magic Palette by Juvia's Place. As you know, Juvia's Place is my favorite eyeshadow brand. They create pure and utter magic. It's like it came out of a unicorn's ass. It is so insanely good and it's so affordable. And today they came out with the Magic Palette and it looks like this. I don't know about you, but I am dying over here. Every single time when Juvia's Place comes out with new palettes, I am so fascinated by all the color combos because I would have never thought to put all these colors together, but somehow they work. So today I'm gonna take this palette out for a spin. I wanna try it out, see what I can do with it. You can already see what I did with it, spoiler alert. And basically just sit down and have fun with it and see what the colors do, see what the pigmentation is like. And um, yeah, so without any further ado, if you would like to know what this palette can do, then keep watching. The first color I'll be going in with is Nana. I'm picking this color up on a Ray Morris number no. nine brush and defining my crease with this. And we're gonna go from inner to outer corner. And once you reach that outer corner, you also wanna swoop it out. And now time for my favorite blending technique, taking a clean brush and just wiggling at the edges to make it nice and smooth. And this color is so loaded with a color pigment. I felt a little scared if I was ever gonna be able to blend it out, but with this technique, it just blurs like magic. Going back in with Nana and re-intensifying the colors in the crease. And of course, blend the edges again. Now with MAC Select Cover Up Concealer in NW15, I'm gonna be cutting the lid and creating basically an entire new eye shape. And a little trick for if you have hooded eyelids like I do, go a little bit above your natural crease so that when you look forward, it still peeks through a little bit and you have a way larger looking eye. And now setting that with one of my favorite colors of the palette, Osun. Now with an angled eyeliner brush, the Zoeva 315, I'm going in with Nana again and really crispening up that line of the new crease. For my wing today, I'm gonna to go in with the Urban Decay Razor Sharp Liner in Gold Rush and going right over top with another favorite color of the palette, Nubia. Time to focus on that lower lash line. I'm gonna work Zakia and Nana on my lower lash line and leaving a little gap open on the inner corner to open up my eyes even more. I'm sorry, but this pigment is so rude. It is so disrespectful. It is so pigmented. You only need the, t look at the colors. Then like I said, we're gonna leave a little spot open to put liquid liner in later on, white, to open up the eyes. And in yesterday's video, I talked about my issues with the NYX white liquid liner and everybody recommended this Urban Decay one. It's another razor sharp liner and this is in the color Bump and apparently this doesn't crack, so thank you. I'm putting this on that little gap and once you put the white on there, it will really open up the eyes. And to seal the deal, I'm gonna use Bella Lashes by New Bouncem. Ever since yesterday, I've fallen in love with them again. I really like what they did in the Wonder Woman look. So here we go. Oh. 
All right, time for the cheeks. I'm first gonna bronze up. This is a standard step, nothing new air. This also nothing new air. For a little bit of contour today, I'm gonna go into the Naked Skin Shape Shifter Palette by Urban Decay. When you open it on this side, it's got powders, and then once you flip the mirror over, you got creams. I already powdered my face, so no creams here, so we're gonna go back, go back to the powder. Powder, and I'm gonna grab this color right here to do a little bit of contour, just a tiny bit, nothing too much. Okay, that's brown. Oh my god. Oh my god, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, so that is a serious shade of brown. Let's uh, tone that down a little bit. For blush, I'm gonna go in with a teensy bit of X-rated blush by Kylie Cosmetics. For highlight today, I'm gonna go in with this BH Spotlight Highlight Palette. This is so good. This is affordable blinding and everything. And today I'll be using these two colors right here. Ugh. I don't know if it's because of this brush, but ever since I've been using this brush for a highlighter, everything has been so intense and so good. So I don't know if it's the brush. Well, the product is amazing, but like because of the brush, it goes on so smoothly and so reflectively. I mean, you can do your makeup in the reflection of my cheek. For lips today, I wanna to go in with this new Maybelline product. This is a liquid lipstick that stays on like no, like nobody's business. This is the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink, and this is in the color 05 Loyalist. I saw this on Karen's channel, I Love Sarai, and the swatches did not lie. Like she could barely remove these from her lips and her arms, and that's when I know I will really like something. So let's apply this to the lips. And that guys concludes this quick little playtime using the new Juvia's Place palette, the magic palette. I love you so much. I absolutely adore this baby right here. And I think the possibilities with this one are endless. You got your warm tone colors. You got your cool tone colors. This color right here. Oh, I think this palette is a must have like any other Juvia's Place palette. They're affordable. I still don't know how they do it. Such an incredible formula for such an amazingly low price. It, it, it's mind boggling. All right, so for a full list of every single product mentioned and used throughout this entire video, go to my description box below or at nakedtutorials.com. As always, if you enjoyed watching this video, then please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit the notification bell to get a notification every time I upload. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching again. I love you so much and I will see you very, very soon. Bye.